Well, camp has been great uh, every day just to come out here and uh, try to work on something different and uh, just learn learn as fast as possible. The uh, game, game's right around the corner, so uh, we got to be ready regardless of what happens. So. What was today's thing you wanted to work on? Uh, today was just, uh, since we came off of off day yesterday, it was just to uh, keep the energy that we had from the last practice and uh, try to improve today. Uh, we're up and down today, so uh, we gotta come back with the right mindset tomorrow. How much have you uh, benefited from uh, this season's camp? Uh, you know, uh, I've benefited a lot just uh, being out here with Coach Vince and Coach Az, just with uh, some new stuff they've thrown at us, and uh, just the pace that we've been going at, moving at pretty quick. Uh, our defense is rolling right now. Uh, I think everyone's working together really well, so uh, I think we're doing fine right now. How do you feel about this uh, this year's unit? Uh, you know, I'm I'm excited to see what we can do. Uh, every day is a working progression, and uh, you know we we come out here and battle every day. And uh, right now, uh, our test day is uh, in two weeks from now, so uh, we'll, we'll figure out what we're what we're about when come that time. What do you ask us? How do you feel like it's compared to what Uh You know, Coach Vince has been working on that a lot. That's just been uh, something big with our D line to work on is our pass rush and getting off the ball. <laughs> Uh, last year we we didn't have too much of that as you can see, but this year is a big emphasis for us, and uh, we're headed in the right direction for sure. What do you think you have improved on the most since last year? Uh, for sure, just knowing the playbook and uh, having a year under my belt now, just uh, kind of familiar with everything. I'm able to help our younger boys. Sometimes I don't even know it, so I ask the older boys around me. Uh, they're able to help me out. Other than that, just being in uh, being in there, I feel stronger than last year for sure. Uh, no, just every day is a working day. So things have slowed down for you as far as learning. You know. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily say slowed down, but uh, it's became a, a bit easier. Okay. Uh, just with the new stuff they've thrown at us, we uh, every day we're working on that. Every walkthrough we're working on that, trying to uh, make it sec second nature, and uh, it's coming along. And how impressive was it that your teammate here won a gold medal? Man, that's great. Uh, you know, he he had to, he had to make a tough decision either to go and go, and he did. And uh, man, we nothing but happiness for him. And uh, our new thing is Mudita, so Mudita for Otito. What, what does that, that mean? Mudita is uh, uh, celebrating with our team, and uh, you know, you see, we uh, we have a lot of if we have a big play, we can go and celebrate with our other teammates, and uh, that good juju can rub off rub off on some of the on some of them. So. How do, you, how do you spell Mudita? M-U-D-I-T-A? Okay. Yeah. Where, where did that word come from? Uh, you know, we just, uh, it came from uh, the Alabama softball team. Yep, Alabama softball team. And Coach Kelly brought that here, and uh, we've been we've been working on that. And when did you start using it? Uh, as of last week. Oh, okay. As of last week. It was, uh, it was a message that we were taught last week, so. Uh, I see it happen at practice, you know. Someone got a pick today. Everybody was celebrating with him, and uh, you know he brings some good juice to our, our defense. How important is is that just that feeling of good energy, keeping good vibes on the football field? It's been a long camp. It's going to be a long season. Making sure you emphasize just being happy together. Man, that, it, it's a big thing, uh, especially with our D line. Uh, we've been up and down these past couple practices, or just throughout camp, and uh, uh, just the energy that we have uh, this past week and. Uh, just trying to uh, help each other and uh, just give good energy has helped us uh, not be tired and not think about ourselves when we're in those uh, fatigue stages, just uh, help somebody else and uh, brings the energy of our group up and uh, we're able to produce. Any of the D-linemen play chess with those guys? Uh, there's a few of us. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure who, but there's a few D-linemen that got picked. I know there is, it's been a majority offensive players. Oh, okay. but, uh, you didn't, you didn't I, I wasn't able to participate. Okay. I'll learn on my own. Right. You, you get picked to play chess? Like someone uh, someone I mean, I, I know there was a little sign-up thing going on, but uh, a lot of the players got picked, so. Do, did you know Ciale from, from high school? All right, so I met Ciale at the Ar Army game. He was on the sideline when we were warming up for the game, and it was the first time I met him there, and then uh, he was from Oakland, so I uh, just kind of had that Polynesian relationship, just kind of uh, knew him, heard about him throughout high school, and then uh, his senior year, just try to uh, build a closer relationship. Uh, him being from the Bay is a great thing to add to our defensive line. Happy for him to be here. He's happy to be here. Uh, he's comfortable. Uh, and that's just the main thing. Just make sure he's happy and uh, he feels at home with us. What was, what's it like to have one, 
one more of your Bay Area brothers with you. Man, it, this is just a blessing for sure. Uh, just to have another, uh, not only he's from the Bay Area, but he's uh, he's Tongan as well. I'm Tongan, so uh, it's just something just to, we understand, we speak our language to each other. So, uh, you know, it just is the type of guys we need in here. So. Awesome. Thank Appreciate you. it.